In this video, I want to go over the integration between Yscout and Sports Code. So I'm here on a team page under the Full Matches tab. If I want to send one of these games to Sports Code, I can do it in either two ways. My preferred way is by selecting the game and sending it to the Huddle Library. That way it joins the XML and the video together. And in Sports Code, I can just go File, Open from Huddle. The other way I can get it into Sports Code is by downloading the video separately and then also downloading the XML separately and bringing them together in Sports Code. However, that is a little bit of a longer process. So if I send it to the Huddle Library, I can select the team I want to send it to, which angle, and typically there might be a wide angle available as well, and then what XML, either the player-based or the team-based XML, or both. Once it's been sent to the Huddle Library, which also allows your athletes to access that video as well, I can then go File, open from huddle and then I can download the game into sports code. So what does the game look like once it's in sports code? Well here's a game. Now when you download it through that method of sending it to the huddle library first, it's going to put the XMLs, the team and the player based XML in two different timelines. Here's the team based XML and to access the player XML I just have to go to this new manage timelines drop down and select the player based. Now the benefit of getting XMLs from Yscout is the much larger availability of data. So if I open the matrix, you can see all of the different labels that I now have access to. So with this player-based XML, I have passes and defensive actions and shots and even things like progressive runs, as well as some locational and positional data. For the team-based XML, I have very similar data. However, it's not as individual but it's still based around location as well as different some, some things like shot outcome or position outcome. Now with all this label data, you can run some really cool output windows. So here's an output window that I have that takes this team-based XML and gives me some basic numbers. I can click on any of these numbers to get the video or with the new feature in sports code that allows you to right click these output buttons and send the video straight to an organizer. If you want help making an output report like this, contact your sales rep and they can put you in touch with an implementation consultant here at Huddle. So Yscout also has integration with our other products like Studio, and I'll leave a link in the description below for a video on how that integration works. There's also integration with our Insight product, which is around data collection. Thank you for watching and I hope this was helpful.